Hello YouTube. Um, I would like to do, I'm doing a room tour. It's been a year. I tend to do these every year, once a year. Um, so this is the 22 edition of my room tour. So uh, on the road to 1k um, in subscriptions, I'm 974 subs. So please help me out. If you're not subscribed, like, share and comment is the game um, for this uh, video please and um, yeah help me get to a thousand subs please so we'll we'll start with my Marvel Legends and my graded books so we've got a few X-Men uh, Marvel Legends going on we've got some Silver Age X-Men CGC uh, books there's X-Men number two I'm sorry about the glare there's a wee bit of a glare um, so right there Jim Sterenko signed book J. Scott Campbell signed book right there. And a Wallace Patasio signed book. So, very cool. And then up here, we have some vintage uh, carded figures. This is the recent vintage range. Um, and then we've got some OG original vintage uh, figures on the shelf up here. And the odd G.I. Joe. I see there's a G.I. Joe amongst it all. But, uh... They're very cool. I'm really happy to have these vintage uh, Star Wars loose figures in my collection. And right here, we have some Black Series plus more of my vintage carded figures. Uh, you would have seen some of these in recent videos. Uh, so you got some Stormtroopers. You've got Luke, Chewie, Han, Ahsoka, and then we've got the Ma Mandalorians. Uh, right here so it's a very cool very cool and then i've got some some bits and pieces up here there's a bit of matilda drew this dread for me a couple of years ago here's my own drawing of wolverine we've got some training cards and and some original art up here uh there's a drawing from uh, a good friend of mine rocco so uh it's really cool so right here, we have got my Doctor Who carded figures up here. And some more trading cards on the walls, as you can see. And then more Doctor Who trading card, uh, figures. So Doctor Who figures. Um, so that is really cool. As you can see, the army of Daleks right there. And then some quite rare figures um, so yeah I'm super happy and then over here we've just got m more stuff we've got a black series TIE fighter hanging on the wall so yeah pretty cool and as you can see here is more uh, carded figures you've seen these figures recently in videos we've got some more uh, black series there we've got some Marvel Legend the 3.75 range I've got quite the collection right there and then down here is my UK comic book uh, annual collection we've got some 2080s Judge Dreads there's a Doctor Who annual the first ever Doctor Who annual right there so very very cool and then my big Dalek we've also got Judge Dredd, my Judge Dredd statue right there. And then we have got some more carded Marvel Legends, uh, the retro line figures all on my wall. And then we've got some Darth Vader's, an OG Darth Vader with uh, a recard and a vintage uh, Darth Vader. And then we have got uh, Boba Fett the retro and... A Mando and then the uh, droid Boba Fett and down here we have got some X-Men pops and I had uh, and the Toy Biz uh, Wolverine and then we've got it looks like a superpower Green Lantern a G.I. Joe a vintage uh, Star Wars box there and some Action Force figures right, just right there and my TARDIS so right here we have my battle action, or battle uh, action force, battle action. Said several names. Uh, 
UK comic book collection. This just came out recently. Um, so uh, I am really happy. There's battle number one. Um, and I'm still missing a few issues, but I've got 75% uh, of the run went from 1975 to what, 987, I think. Um, so yeah, we've got down here my Alex Ross uh, collection of those timeless covers. There's a Phoenix one, there's a Thor, so they're there. There's another graded book, first blink right there. Um, here is my 2000 AD uh, collection. There's the first Judge Dread. There's number one. I need one issue to get the first 500 uh, progs, as they're called. So, uh, and a mate of mine called Frank's Cards and Collectibles uh, just acquired me that book. So that's on its way from Canada. So thank you very much, Frank. So, uh, yeah. And then... Here's more 2080 and miscellaneous UK stuff, and, and uh, so yeah, pretty cool. Right here is my signed uh, graphic novel of uh, God Loves, Man Kills by Chris Claremont and Brent Anderson. Uh, Chula and Evan Gillon helped me acquire this uh, about three years ago, and then it got sent off to CBCS by Chula, I think it was. Um, thank you very much, both of you too. Uh, and there's a photo. I've got a photo of Chris Claremont and Brian Anderson holding this book in their hands after it being signed. So yeah, very awesome, very awesome. And uh, here's a couple of recent pickups. So we got the first Jane Foster Thor, and uh, the first Professor Hulk. Um, so pretty cool. And then we've got my signed Judge Dredd photo. By uh, John Wagner, the creator of Judge Dredd. So that is real cool. I've actually got some signed books by John Wagner as well. So really cool. And then we've got some original art that I got from Houdat's Comics, uh, which is really awesome. It was, uh, it's really cool, this. I really like it. So yeah, that's on my wall. And then we've got a treasury edition of Kirby Thor going on there. And my John Lennon uh, Necker uh, that I've had for years. So really awesome stuff and here we go here's a full run of the new mutants uh run i finally achieved my goal of finishing this run this year early this year when, and acquiring this grail book the first deadpool and gideon so i was super super happy to acquire to to uh do this run um it's taken me 30 years <laughs> so yeah pretty awesome here we go. Here's my Silver Age and the beginning of my Bronze Age X-Men run. Um, I have got quite a, quite the X-Men collection in my comic book thing. Um, so I will show you some of these books that I have. It's pretty damn awesome. It's taken me so many years to get to this point. There we go. There's the big boy. Giant size. There's the other one. So... Um, yeah, if you like the X-Men, then, uh, yeah, it's taken me a few years to get here, though I've got, I am only needing uh, X-Men number one, X-Men number one, number three, and number four to complete volume one of the Uncanny X-Men run, so, yeah, um, so, yep, so pretty awesome. And then the rest of these bins is the remainder of the X-Men run. Um, so, yeah. It's pretty awesome, to be honest. And then we've got miscellaneous uh, X-Men books right here. Just the other runs, you know. Volume 1, vo uh, Volume 2, Volume 3 of the X-Men, etc. And the last of the Uncanny, the last Uncanny X-Men run. So, uh, that's pretty cool. we got here. You can see more here. So that's how I do it. So I think, where is it? This one here is the last ever of volume one. And then it goes, I go into order. So I've got everything in order. So it follows where it is. That's volume two and volume three, I think. Um, so, etc. So yeah, that's pretty cool. And then here we have got more stuff. We've got, 
Well, we've got sketch covers, so sketch covers in here, as you can see. Um, a bit of Thor there. We've got there, we've got something from Four Way Flashes. Subscribe to his channel. Uh, so, yep, there's some I did, there's some original art from me. Um, so, yep, and then. All new Wolverine Volume 1, Volume 2, all new Wolverine Volume 1, and then all the 25th anniversary covers are right here. So that stuff there. So yeah. So down here we have got my more comics. I've got my screen run, more UK stuff. There's Marvel Miscellaneous. We have got uh, a lot of uh, boxes full of comic books. Um, down here too as you can see it on my wolverine run i think is in these boxes here um more wolverine just and i've got them labeled so i know what's in them uh so yep it's pretty pretty awesome and then in this long box we've got more x-men stuff uh so just uh it's all the one-offs and limited series and stuff like that. So, uh, yeah, just that sort of stuff in here. So, actually some really cool stuff in here. So, yeah, uh, I'm pretty happy about that. In this box is my complete run of the reprints of Judge Dread uh, Eagle, the Eagle run. Um, I've got the full run, all in Mylar too. Love this cover by Brian Boland. Most of these covers are by Brian, Brian Boland. There's the old one by Mike McMahon and one by Cam Kennedy. But uh, I, I love these books. So we've got some other stuff. This is all Judge Dredd uh, stuff. Yeah, one of my favourite characters, um, Judge Dredd. So I am a huge uh, collector of anything 2080 and Judge Dredd. So I have got so much uh, Judge Dredd stuff it's not funny. So yeah, pretty cool. And then down in this bin, I have got, oh, it's a bit tight in here, but we have got some Thor, there's Silver Age Thor and Bronze Age Thor. So, in that box, and then variant covers. So we've got a bit of Art Germ, I think there's all sorts of Jim Lee var variants, all sorts in here, so um, pretty cool actually. This one, We've got Avengers, there's Avengers stuff, there's a bit of artwork, um, and then Incredible Hulk, like Immortal Hulk, it's about the first 30 issues of the Immortal Hulk, and then my Incredible Hulk run, I've got a few Incredible Hulk books, Incredi the Hulk is my favourite, one of my favourite characters, so yeah, it's pretty cool, and then we have got here a miscellaneous of action figures some of my favorite action figures some recent ones like that Bret Hart and the uh what if uh, Marvel Zombie uh Captain America and my Phantom but these are some of my favorite uh figures so I've got them on display over in this corner so we've got that so Strontium Dog uh He-Man there's some superpowers here and the Apocalypse Toy Biz Juggernaut so yeah pretty cool and on this bookshelf i have got my doctor who collection well some of it there's more doctor who in another room but we've got my uh, big chief uh, david tennant doctor figure and then a lot of boxed figures and then on my daleks and my giant dalek and then um all the doctors in there so and the Cybermen underneath it, as you can see, we've got more Daleks, there's a talking Tom Baker Doctor, so, and then the minifigures, there's all sorts in this bookshelf, uh, I sit there sometimes, look, there's something fell down, <laughs> so, um, I just caught it, then. so yeah, I've got all sorts, and we've got Doctor Who books, right there, and stickers, so, badges uh, there's my doctor who convention bag for the 50th anniversary it's almost 10 years ago so that was pretty cool went to auckland for that so we've got judge dread trades down there 
there's more figurines, more Daleks in there, um, more comic boxes, I think they're full of action figures, um, there's a Womble down there, so, but yeah, that is it, um, so, and then over here, we have got signed uh, Doctor Who pictures, I've got no room for them, there's some down there too of signed Doctor Who uh, celebrities, so, um, this will do for my 2022 uh, room tour. I hope you enjoyed it. Give me a thumbs up if you did. I'm on the road to 1K. Help me get to, on my journey to 1K. Uh, 974 subscribers is uh, where I'm at at the moment. So I'm not far off it. So I would much oblige if you could help me, please. Um, so take care. Ka kite anō. Thank you very much.